Paul, I bet you knew this. The World Squash Championships oh, are being held yes. right now. They're happening in Egypt. USA's Amanda Sobi, who is ranked number four in the world, is currently competing, and she just took down South Africa's Alexandra Fuller over the weekend. Sobi is the first American-born player to crack the world's top ten in squash. She joins us to tell us more about it. Well, I was going to ask you, what is squash? But we are seeing <laughs> video there. It looks a little bit like racquetball. Am I right? Yeah, um, that's usually how I put it. But I like to say it's, um, it's a lot harder and it's way more fun, in my opinion. But the big difference is the size of the ball. Racquetball's uh, bigger and it's bouncier, whereas a squash ball is right, the size so, uh, of the ball. Was, oh my God, yeah, that would make it harder. Yeah, I mean, so. Yeah, and doesn't bounce nearly as much, so huh. you're running a lot more. Oh. So this, uh, the, uh, most of the top players are, are Egyptian, or they have been recently, um, but you have a squash in your family, don't you? Is that how you started? Yes, so everybody in my family plays squash. Actually, my father is from Egypt, so I'm I'm half Egyptian, I'm a dual citizen. And so, you know, once I tell people that, they're like, that is why you're uh, good at squash. <laughs> now, what, is it big anywhere else? How did it, uh, why is it uh, mostly in Egypt the top players come out of there? As of right now, I think it's a generational thing. Ah. Um, started. Yeah, with one Egyptian who kind of inspired a lot, and then kind of my generation and the generation coming up, it's just inspired so many Egyptians. And with, in Egypt, squash is one of the main sports. It doesn't really have the sports like in the US, you know, basketball, um, baseball, hockey. So squash is one of those major sports in yeah. Egypt. Uh, mm. So a lot of people play that. How did you handle the pressure and expectations of growing up in a family with such accomplished squash players? Thankfully, um, I love the sport. I am also the, the one who's paving the way in the family, so I'm the most accomplished one. So I think it's the rest of the family who um, <laughs> probably doesn't like it, yeah. but, uh, being my shadow. <laughs> so the tournament, uh, the World Championships are going on now. You had a win over the weekend. Does it go through next Friday? Where does it stand, Amanda? It goes, so I am now in the round of 16, and it goes until the 22nd. So we play one day and then rest one day but they're setting up a glass court in the uh, Museum of Civilization in Egypt, right by the Nile. So wow. it could be an incredible venue. That is amazing. Well, you can follow Amanda and her progress on social media. You can also check out her website, amandasobi.com. Amanda, thanks for thanks, joining Amanda. us and good luck. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it.